Well, because I got a bit hungry leading up to dinner, we've got a little bonus. Um, this is a tuna pasta bake that we're going to make today. And um, I'm going to get on with it. <laughs> okay. Good afternoon, everyone. Today we're going to make a tuna pasta bake. So we're going to start off this bake with about four tablespoons full of butter. We're going to add one large chopped red onion to that and then we're going to pop in our tuna chunks um, but we're going to add some hot English mustard um, to this as well and some grated cheese uh, for our sauce uh, as well as some um, milk. So let's um, get chopping on the onions, the red onion. So this is one red onion here, um, quite a large one, in fact it's the largest one I could find in the shop. Um, so um, I'm going to just chop that roughly and pop it in with that butter. Right at the same time we're doing that and uh, we've put on some uh, water to boil here for our penne pasta which should be really soon. And here we've got um, around about 190 grams of uh, flaked uh, tuna and I've got um, what amounts to about two tablespoons of hot English mustard. So that's going to go into the sauce. Meanwhile the onions are just simmering away here, probably another five or ten minutes to go. Right into our onions I've just put three tablespoons full of flour um, and then I'm going to top that up with around about 400 mils of, of milk um, and stir it until it's thick. Right now I have a bowl of penne pasta. I'm going to pop that in there and just let that cook until it's al dente. As you can see the milk is now in there and it's um, starting to thicken up. As soon as it does we'll add the cooked um, penne pasta. Oh we haven't put the um, oh we haven't put the tuna in there yet. Better pop that in. And you're probably saying oh he's forgotten to add the grated cheese and you're right. So I'll pop the grated cheese in plus you can see in the foreground there suspiciously a um, dessert spoon of whole grain mustard. Well I'm going to put that in too and I may yet put some more mustard in. This is a time when you taste um, your sauce and add things, and in this case mustard, um, really does uh, show off this dish so don't be shy. Once your pasta is cooked, um, drain it and then add your sauce. So we'll just stir that sauce through afterwards and then we'll pop it in a container, cover it in grated cheese and pop it in the oven for a bit. And there you are, a bit of ground black pepper and some grated cheese and we'll pop that in the oven. Lovely. And that's what it looks like once it's out the oven. Beautiful. Well thank you for watching. I'm going to go and uh, tuck into this. Um, uh, please remember to like and subscribe if you want to see more yummy recipes like this. Alright, catch you on the next recipe.